Hi everyone, welcome back to another episode of Africa Reacts where we react to comedy, music and stories across the globe. If you don't know me, my name is Faye and I appreciate you for stopping by. So if you are new to this channel, feel so welcome and feel at home. And if you are a returning subscriber, welcome back. So in this episode, I'm going to be reacting to a song request from uh, one of my very loyal viewer and subscriber, that is Daniel M. And the song I'm reacting to is uh, 1985 by bowling for soup and uh, i'm reacting to the official video version of it and i cannot wait to see what this song has to offer and i hope you take this journey with me all the way to the end and as always i'll be giving my interpretation and comment at the end of the video so i hope to see you there and without wasting much of your time let's jump directly into this song 1985 and see what it's all about <laughs> Wow, this song is really amazing. I'm loving it. 1985. It's such an amazing song. And the fact that I can hear Nirvana being named and uh, Biscuit, it's amazing. I'm really loving the song and I hope you are loving it as well. So if you love the song, don't forget what we normally do, right? Smash that like button and leave me a comment sharing what you love about this song. As for now, let's continue watching and I hope to see you at the end of the video. Remember, I'll be giving my interpretation and comment so you can't, meet up, me, you can't <laughs> afford to miss out. So let's continue watching and I think I'm just so overexcited. That's why I don't know what I'm saying. So let's continue watching. <laughs> Made of snakes. Wow, what an end. 
I loved that. Honey, what are you doing? <laughs> that was amazing. What a performance. I really love this song. 1985. It's an amazing one. And Bowling for Soup didn't let us down. This is amazing. I loved it. And I hope you did as well. So... I think I'm just laughing so hard. <laughs> so if you love the video, don't forget what we normally do, right? Smash that like button and leave me a comment sharing what you loved most about this song. As for me, it was the end part. That was amazing. <laughs> that killed it all. So I love this song. It's an amazing one. And uh, so Daniel M, thank you so much for requesting this song. It's an amazing one. I've had a good, 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 good time watching it. So thank you so much. And guys, I hope you've had a good time watching this song. Thank you too for watching it all the way to the end. So if you are here, I know you're waiting for my comment and interpretation. So I just gave my comment saying it's an amazing one. And uh, what I loved about it is uh, the fact that it was mentioning uh, some of the artists that... Uh, I now know by now because I've reacted to them, which was an amazing thing because I think if I reacted to this song, like if it was requested or I did it very early, I wouldn't be getting the lyrics, but having a uh, react, like reacting to it, <laughs> what am I saying? I think I'm just so excited. Reacting to it at this point in time is amazing because I love, I, I know most of the things that it's talking about. Like uh, it mentioned, it mentioned Nirvana, uh, the MTV, which is the part of uh, the MTV and flag series that I do uh, on Sundays. I hope you're watching that. So right now we are on Nirvana, MTV and flag, and we just finished Alice in Chains. So it's an amazing thing. So getting to know that and then there's a part that was talking about Bruce, Bruce Spring, Spring, Springsteen. That's also one of the artists that I've reacted to. And uh, then there's the Ozzy. There's the Ozzy. Uh, then uh, who, who else? There's another person that uh, they mentioned that uh, I've also reacted to. So pretty much it's an amazing song. And uh, yeah, Madonna. So it's an amazing song. And I loved it so, so much. So what I can say about it, like uh, you could see it was talking a lot about 1985. And uh, this lady, she's back in the 1985 and uh, a teenage child is just telling her that she ain't cool and all that and at the end we saw she decided to follow her dream and uh, went out and joined the band guys and started dancing because she wanted to be a star as we are told in the song because uh, uh, we are told yeah i think we are told that oh i forgot to mention limp biscuits in my previous whatever my previous comment uh so there's a part that's talking about him not being cool. The teenage, yeah, the high school kid. Her two high school, her, her two kids in high school, they tell her that she ain't, she's uncool. But she's still preoccupied with the 1919-1985. So she's preoccupied by the past. And uh, so she it seems like she has begun to get, get out of her shell and uh, just be herself. So as we could see, even the style of dressing was uh, something that I assume is from 1985 and all that. And then she changed all of a sudden. And the part where the husband was asking <laughs> at the end, that was amazing. I loved it. So I hope you love this song. And I'm looking forward to hearing what you have to say about it. So let me not talk too much because I'm so excited and I can talk the whole day. So thank you for watching. And if you are new to this channel, uh, don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell. So that you get notified each and every time I post a video. Also, if you wish to support the channel, you're very welcome to do so. All you need to do is check the description below. And there you'll find the link to my Patreon account. And you will also find my PayPal address. And you can have a guaranteed request through the same platforms like Daniel M. Uh, from as low as only $5. So it's affordable and I cannot wait to react to your favorite comedy, music and stories. So thank you so much for watching and I hope to see you in the next episode. Until next time, take care of yourself, be safe and may God bless you. Bye.